Hello everybody, my name is Storm here. Welcome back to Transport Beaver 2. In the last episode, we were able to get our iron production up and running. And we built our line out here to our machines factory. We kind of reworked our tunnel a little bit over here. I don't know if it's actually going to help or not, but that's what I did. And... Yeah, now we need to figure out how to get silver, which I decided on where we're going to put our silver mill. We're going to put our silver mill right here. And then we're going to run silver ore into the mill, then run the silver bars in the machines factory. And then we'll have to figure out how to distribute the machines into various cities. Into Kajani is going to be easy, but... Uh, elsewhere is going to be a little bit more difficult. We're probably going to be from this machine's factory. We're probably only going to be going into McKelly and Rauma. We, we might have some options here, so we'll just have to see how it goes. All right, so. Let's go ahead and get things started here. Yeah, we're starting to get some steel. We just we just need more iron ore. You know, we need more iron ore moving. And why are you just sitting there? Uh-huh. Oh, I think I see why that might be happening. There's no signal. Because that signal is actually down there, not up on the bridge. Hmm. Now, the only thing you should actually have available to pick up is iron ore. All right, let's get this going and then we'll figure this out. So we're going to go ahead and we're going to put in I think we're gonna go for the big warehouse. The big warehouse over here. City new. Enabled. Wall era C. Make these all nice. Lane two way city road. Yeah, probably. And we're probably going to have uh, actually. We're we're going to be putting tram on that line. Actually, the more I think about it, we're probably going to need that to be four lane. With... That. All right. We're, we'll get to that um, at some point here. Now, I don't think I want the trams running on this stretch of road, right? Because that is, that is kind of the road that connects the cities. 
I would prefer to have it as straight shots. So what I'd like to do here is let's take this road out. Here's the thing. If we go bridge, we're going to have to go over top of that train or We're gonna have to go tunnel. Hmm. Let's see. Let's go. Let's go over top. Oh, it's gonna have to be a little bit taller than that. Nope. Just a little bit taller than that. Collision. No, we need you to be. Yeah, just like that. That. That height. to be level oh right i need to um bring that back down to to ground level I think is what we're gonna want all right so we need tram track on there with electric thing that we're going to set up right now is this you coming into there that's a road freight to Johnny silver or you should be able to get from here to there And we're going to need open. Yeah, give me like, I don't know, eight of those. Because apparently need tons of transport capacity for the silver ore.
All right, so they'll make their way. New planes, new locomotives, new buses, and the Peterbilt 352 trucks. So we actually now have a truck that is worth using. Okay, that's a thought. That is a thought. Hmm. I have to compare it against certain trams. Now these trams, they're fine. Most likely what we would end up doing is using those to deliver goods into cities off of and without being confined to the tram, the tram routes. So, probably a good thing. All right, so the other thing we want to do is... Yeah, we can do a level crossing there. Fine. is a train or a tram set Nakajani just silver bars now for silver bars We would need this. And we want to bring machines back, I think. So I would need a combination. Of steak cars and box cars. These guys. Did I misname this or something? Oh, I did. Loads of silver here already. Okay, so that should bring machines back to here. Now... Now, fortunately for us, this city has already been pretty well upgraded. We just didn't have... Um, bus lanes available at the time. But we do now, so we can throw bus lanes. And that should really be all that's needed in terms of road upgrades. And we still have the city well covered. Yep. 
What about the actual trams? Like, what are we using here? They're 42 years old. What are we using? We are using Peter Witt streetcars. These guys. We can upgrade them to these. Oh, the other thing we gotta do is, uh... Recolor. All right. Now, where do we need the machines? That is also what matters. Machines are all here, this side of town. But we're gonna want this delivery area to cover as much as possible, right? So in reality, we would probably want it to be right about there. Now, the slight problem is that we will want to upgrade our streets to four lane, two way city road with bus lane. Construction not possible. Why is construction not possible? I would say construction is in fact possible. Just needed the right kind of road there. All right. still the best option and that'll regrow back in to where it's supposed to be we're going to use these trucks Yeah, we have a bit of a traffic jam as uh, as the uh, the trams kind of bed in a little bit. I have to see how much. Yeah, it looks like actually we're not. Yeah, we could actually take these and replace them with the fours. I think, and it looks like that, that would be fine. There's the deliveries. We're going to need an actual road depot rather than a tram depot, which that's fine. We can squeeze one of those in here. Or not. Right there, then. All right. Cargo. These have a 36 capacity.
They carry machines, bricks, tools, food, pretty much everything that we're going to want here. Um, what are the trams? Like, if I were to use these guys, 22 capacity in two compartments. 28 capacity in four compartments. How many compartments are in uh, these trucks? Four compartments. Yep. They are currently the best city distribution vehicles that we have. Give me a couple of them. Now, these are only going to be coming through here this time, because they're going to be coming in from this side pretty much all the rest of the time. Alright, and so now we should have machines. We do have machines. Did you pick up any machines? You did not yet. So this... That one's picked up some. That one picked up a few as well. Alright, good. All right, that will work. Now, this train should I modify it with What's his maximum speed? Uh, we're using what? These guys, 104 kilometers per hour. Cargo. I think we're using these. Yes. So we would need some box cars. Machines back to here. Then from there, we could distribute into Rauma. It is not picking up 
Hmm. Okay, then let's do this. You load fifty percent and fifty percent. Half the train with coal, half the train with iron. And let's see if that helps. Make sure that we're getting iron ore. Yeah, because we're getting so much coal going through. Yeah, manage the line. Let's do the same thing here. Where's that train? There it is. Okay, so yeah, even if like a big load of coal comes through here, like from this guy, it'll always make sure that we're picking up some iron as well. things are going to do is probably going to modify this with a second terminal. I need to get that train out of the way first. Yep. Get you out of the way. There we are. All right. We're probably even bring that back to there. Okay, so configure. Just in case I decide to bring things through. I'm going to set this up the way I have been setting things up. We'll have to have our crossover on the bridge, but that, that just is what it is. It'll be fine. Maybe it'll be fine. Uh, where's our switches? Our switches are there. Okay, good. So then we're going to want another line, because do we have an open terminal? 
we do not have an open terminal. I can make one. Yeah, easy enough. And yeah, I'm also gonna need the signals over here. There and there, right? Okay, so then we will set up a new line from here to there using the correct terminal is. All right, this is gonna be train freight from the machines. Uh, new stuff to have on comets. General cargo vessel type 507B. Okay. Where's the. There it is. This is going to be relatively small. So let's go with the diesels. We'll do um, an EMD GP9. With a few boxcars on it. Put six boxcars on it. This is Realm of Machines. There we go. Carrying some steel. Okay. So then what we're going to need to do is over here. Uh, there's the road. Okay. There's that. Yeah, it's fine. Now, this intercity road, uh, we're going to want to upgrade. So, we're going to want to turn you into six lane, two way city road. We don't need bus lane on it. Alright, and at this point, we're switching over to six lane, two way urban expressway. And that's coming in to McKelly here. We need to make sure we have bus lane. There 
green bus lane on that stretch of road. We're going to need six lane, two way city road here. Right. Okay. And then we're going to want warehouse. Warehouse there. And we're going to need a warehouse. There. And we will need bus lane. Coming in to here. Alright. Now, we need freight distribution points. Like, over here is going to be good. I think. Actually, like, right... Right there might actually be best. There's the fuel. We're probably actually going to need two. For right now... Is there, are we bringing fuel in? I mean, hold on, hold on. Yeah, we are bringing fuel in. Via tram. Okay, so this one, this is going to be deliveries two. Deliveries 2 is going to come up here. Right, because this is not actually going to be able to carry fuel. Fine, okay. I'm on Deliveries 2. Guess we get a couple of the Peterbilts. And we put that on Rama Deliveries 2. Right? And then over here. Like this is the industrial side of town. things up. I accidentally... Okay, that, that looks like that's working correctly now. Um, then maybe right about here? 
Yeah, we'll put it right about there. And then we can do a line from there to there. We'll figure out what it's going to do. Deliveries there. I think I can use this. Buy a couple of those. And send them on their way. All right. Now. You are, in fact, mostly using the correct roads. If that little shortcut causes problems, we'll upgrade it. Well, you know what, I'm on you. I'll just go ahead and upgrade it right now. It's going to be a four-lane, two-way city road with bus lane. That's easy enough. Okay. And what route is this taking? Uh, it's coming straight down the middle of town. Okay, so we're going to need to do the same thing. Four lane, two way city road with bus lane right down the center of town, which probably should have been done anyway. That'll do. All right. Now what we should start to see is machines on there. And you're loading up machines. That's excellent. And you're getting a good load of steel. Even better. This is not profitable. Um, but we'll see. Uh, it doesn't necessarily need to be profitable. We're about to break a billion dollars in the bank. I gotta make sure that we don't have like traffic jams anywhere. Nothing looks crazy. That's good. And these steel mills should be getting loads of Iron ore now, so that's good. Trains are making a profit. Now, the other thing that I want to check. Mountain freight line. That train's making a profit. That train's making a profit. Okay, you're going up the hill, not down. Okay, so I'm like... It could still probably use another train, but I, I think we're fine. I think I think we're fine. Uh, yeah, because we still got we still got stuff in stock here. All right. Well, this is where we're gonna go ahead and end this particular episode. So we we should be getting machines delivered into these three cities. We still need machines to be delivered into Jokmok there. And into Umea. And into Gothenburg. And into Vastervik. Hmm. 
So, I'll decide what it is we're going to do next episode. We do need to come back to this region again and take a look at all the freight, but we might worry about that later. It's working. That's what matters. So another thing we could do is try and get the structure materials up and running. We have a quarry there. We could bring that in. We could make bricks and we could send bricks into Kajani. Falun is already getting bricks. It's possible. All right. Well, we'll see. But for now, we'll stop here. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. Thanks for watching. Go ahead, like, subscribe, and comment, and I will see you next time.